Hey guys, I'm Alejandra. And I'm Caroline. And today we're making peanut butter candy bars. Growing up, I used to love nougat candy bars. And during Halloween, I used to actually kind of like go through the entire candy bag <laughs> looking for it. And then also steal my brother's. <laughs> so it's amazing that I can now make them myself. And you can too. So some pretty easy ingredients here. Some melted butter, some mini marshmallows, a little bit of salt, some vanilla extract, some smooth operator peanut butter, some yum bunny dulce de leche, and some roasted peanuts. Okay, so let's get started. I already have some butter in my pot just melted. Instead, I'm gonna add the marshmallows. Really nice and easy, and just kinda give them a stir until they melt. So we can also add our peanut butter. So we're doing about a half cup of peanut butter in here. I love peanut butter and marshmallow together. Oh, it's so good. And our dulce de leche, which has been another one of my favorite things since I was a kid. All of that in there. And this is great. This is a milk uh, caramel. So it's made with milk and sugar. It's so delicious. I like where this is going. Oh, yeah. There's a lot of yummy things in here. So keep stirring and that heat just bringing everything together. So while I keep doing this, how about we get some of these peanuts in the pan? We're gonna sure. do half of them in the bottom of our baking pan. And I already lined it with a little bit of parchment paper because that's gonna make it easy to get the candy out later. Easy enough. And look how nice it's got that great golden brown color. So now you can go ahead and add that vanilla. Sure. Just stir that in. Okay, so now you gotta be really quick with this. You've already got the nuts in there. So we're just gonna pour it all into the pan slides right out. How easy is that? Then I'm just going to use a small spatula or the back of a spoon works well. And you just want to spread that caramel evenly over the peanuts. Ooh, that's so easy. So easy. All right. And now do you want to take the rest of those yeah. peanuts and just want to pour them right over the top and we'll use all of them. Perfect. And then just use your hands. I kind of like to press them in a little bit. So that kind of brings everything together. It's so simple. I had no idea that making candy was so easy. So easy, right? So now this is going to go into the fridge for about three hours or just until it's set and it'll harden and then we can take them out and cut them and add our final finishing touch. So got this out of the fridge. It chilled and it's nice and solid. So this is why I put that parchment paper there because it makes it so easy to just lift it out. And you pull it aside and now we can cut and see how it's got those great layers. So fun. It's awesome. I know. There we go. Just kind of use a nice sharp knife. A little bit of elbow grease. Nice sharp knife and a little bit of elbow grease. And perhaps a ruler because I can't cut straight <laughs> lines. <laughs> In this case, it looks like the biggest and sharpest knife you got is the one that you want to use for this. Exactly. These would be awesome enough on their own, but I love to gild that lily. So we're actually going to add a little bit of melted chocolate drizzle right on top. Ooh. And just kind of drizzle it right over the bars. Feels very appropriate for Halloween. Oh, totally. So now once you get the chocolate on here, we want to pop these back into the fridge for about 30 minutes just to let them set. The chocolate will harden. And then we can eat, eat them. them. Eat them. Yes. So for Halloween, it's always fun to bring in candy bars for coworkers or to give them to your friends. Parties. If you have a party. And I think it's kind of fun if you do it in cute little bags. Oh, cute. So we've got these little spiderweb bags here. You can get any kind you like. Just pop one bar in. It's adorable. So cute, right? How cute is that? So there you have it, peanut butter candy bars. All right, so now you get to take your pick and we can try these. All right. Mmm. Mmm. Totally cool. Try to get Super cool point for having made these. These are awesome. Yeah. Hopefully it tastes just like the ones I used to love as a kid. With a little bit of a chocolatey grown up twist. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We made this candy bar using peanuts and peanut butter. What are some of your favorite candy bar ingredients? Let us know in the comments section. Thanks for watching. We hope you liked this recipe. And if you did, give us a thumbs up. Every week we cook up a new peanut buttery dish. So follow the Peanut Butter and Company channel to make sure you catch them all. We'll see you next time. smell. It's just me. <laughs> no, yeah, I think yeah. so. Yeah, there's no. Whatever you're ready. They are, right? Yeah. Okay.